guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the Thor Ragnarok Gladiator Hulk build figure wave, the mighty Thor, or just Thor. Not really sure, I don't really want to call it Lady Thor, because it does not say, and people are, aren't really, you know, I don't know, I'm just going to call it Thor. Anyways, you can see Mighty Thor there, nice little art there, little font, I don't know. You can see Jane Foster there, looks pretty sick, I love this art. That looks awesome. Here's the back. You can see the figure. If you want to read the read up, pause it. I know. Here's all the other figures in this wave. I am reviewing Ares tomorrow, so come back, subscribe, come back tomorrow, and you'll see the review up. Um, at around you know two. Uh, but yeah, uh, there's a lot of figures in this wave that everyone was looking for. Uh, at first, that everyone was looking for um. I think everyone was looking for uh, uh, Jane Foster. Then they were looking for Hela. Now everyone's looking for Ares, and some people are still looking for Hela. So I'm just very lucky, I, I guess. But there's that amazing art right there again. That looks really cool. I would love to get this as a print. Uh, maybe I'll bring it to a Comic Con and have like an artist actually do it, or ask someone. I don't know. Let me know if you know the artist of this, cause I would love to find at least the comic, and then maybe I can frame it. Anyways, you can see Mjolnir right there, and that's about it for packaging. Let's get this gal opened up and see how cool she really is. All right, we got Lady Thor out of the packaging, and yeah, I like this figure a lot as well. Um. I'm very happy to add, like, uh, I'm thinking, I, I wasn't going to do this before, but I just saw it slowly being formed. Uh, so I'm just going to actually just try to complete the new Avengers uh, display, all new, all different Avengers. She keeps falling back, though. I think it's just because she's a little back heavy with the cape. But that's about it. But, uh, yeah, I, I already have Miss Marvel, Miles Morales, Kid Nova. Uh, I need to, I want to pick up that three pack now that I, you know, said that I want to complete this whole, you know, team. So, and they just announced Invincible Iron Man. So, I definitely need to pick that up too. Plus, I really want uh, an Iron Man. I need a classic one too, but there, I know that's coming. So, uh, it's nice to know that Hasbro is making a lot of figures. And it feels so good to be a fan of Marvel Legends right now. Because they know they're fan the fan base is a big fan base so they make sure they make plenty for everyone uh yeah but yeah her cape does come off and it stays on fairly well i think it's just mine that doesn't stay on very good well let's take a look at mjolnir i think i'm saying it right let me know if i'm saying it wrong but uh yeah i i guess this is the age of ultron thor's hammer of mjolnir which I actually thought was, uh, pretty interesting. You know, come on, I want to focus. There we go. Uh, but yeah, you can see all the nice details, intricate details in here. It is a little war warped, so I'm definitely going to have to heat it up and straighten it out, but I think it looks pretty good. Love the handle, and you get this piece right here. Yeah, pretty cool. And, uh... Yeah, I'll try to review her with the cape on, but if it gets annoying, then I'm just going to take it off. So, uh, focus. Here we go. Uh, yeah, this head, the helmet kind of freaked me out the first time I saw it. If I'm going to be honest. Uh, the pop, no, because, you know, the pops are very different from the original source material. So, but, uh... Yeah, this kind of freaks me out. All black eyes and silver pupils. Yeah, that kind of freaks me out a little bit. But you can see the gold uh, outline there. I don't really know what that is. Love the red lipstick. That looks awesome. Wow. Love the blonde hair as well. You get this chest piece. It's gray. Kind of silver. Get that gold piece right there, and you get some nice paint apps here. You can see her uh, skirt piece. You can see nice brown and yellow and silver here. It looks pretty nice. Now, I'm just going to take the cape off so you can see the back of the figure. Not as impressive as the front, but this cape is very nice, too. I'm just going to point this out while I was off. Um, but yeah, 
really do like this cape. Uh, I like the how it's like just does this curve of flow. I don't know. Just the silver parts there. And like I said, it is quite easy. You kind of got to slide underneath the hair and then poured it in. Now, uh, I didn't, I only read one comic with her once, and it was Deadpool and Spider-Man, or Spider-Man and Deadpool. Uh, volume 1, isn't it? Romantic. Yeah, my mom got me it for, uh, for Christmas last year, so it was very memorable. I just finished it not too long ago, which actually just reminds me that I need to, uh, actually put it on my bookcase instead of my backpack, because I read it to school. But yeah, very nice figure. I love this armor piece, too. And then the boots are cool, too. I wouldn't mind having these boots. Get the wraps. These flash kind of things there. Uh, anyways, articulation. The head will move up quite a bit. For, for you know, a female with the hair. Yeah, that's quite a bit. She will look down all the way. She will look side to side. She does have a bit of a head pivot. The arm will move out like so. It can do a 360, but I'm not going to do it because I don't want to knock off the cape. She has a bicep swivel, single bend at the elbow. Doesn't really meet the 90 degree, unfortunately, but uh, she does have a swivel with the hand and hinge. There is an ab crunch, or well, no, a diaphragm joint that far back. Very nice. That kind of helps with her head, you know, very, very nice. Uh, she does move forward quite a, a little bit, not a lot, but she can't move side to side, she can't pivot as well. Hip joints move out like so, not a lot. And I, get, and I say this with a lot of figures recently, you're not really going to get her in crazy poses, probably flight poses, and that's about it. When she's kicking someone in, she can kick very nice. She can kick back, a eh, tiny bit could be better. Thigh cut, double joint, and knees, boot rotation, no. Uh, it, it would have been nice because you could kind of hide it too. So I don't know. Feet can hinge and pivot. I can't move the side to side or anything. So ah, that's a little unfortunate. But let's uh get her holding Mjolnir here, and she holds it fairly well. Surprisingly, I'm just afraid that it is a bit heavy for such a small arm or hand, at least. That I'm afraid the joint will get loose. So, that's my only fear about this figure. Other than that, I think it's okay. I, I, yeah. Uh, I'm only going to be doing comic book characters from here on out until the Gladiator Hulk figure. So, just to save time and plus it saves the suspense. Uh, come on. Freaking get off him, Hella. Anyways, get Tom Brady, I mean, Unworthy Thor, I mean, Odinson, <laughs> uh, right next to her. Didn't they come in a two-pack together in the, the three, three-quarter inch? And, like, I heard Shadimus took a giant shard on him, on his figure, but not hers. Yeah. These two would look pretty cool side by side, you know, fighting. Because... I, I mean, is he the unworthy for? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Anyways. Uh, thank you, guys. I don't really know what to use for a thumbnail, if I'm being completely honest. Uh, I'm probably going to try to use this flight stand, which might be a little bit... Oh, difficult, because she has all these skirt pieces and capes and stuff. But, man, this, this whole wave loves their capes. Like, uh, you know... Unworthy Thor has the cape, and, uh, I mean, it's not removable or anything, but this got the cape, Loki's got the cape, yeah, this whole wave's loving the capes. But yeah, she was very funny in, uh, Spider-Man and Peter, uh, no, Spider-Man and Deadpool. I liked her a lot in it, even though she was only in it for like a couple pages, not a whole lot. Uh, but she was very funny, and Deadpool was very funny with her. Yeah, this pose is good. Yeah, come on. Focus on her, please, and thank you. 
And let's get the picture of her and then I can go to bed because it is getting a little bit late. Is that good? Does that, does that please your needs? <laughs> Anyways. Uh, by the way, I got a new knife. I'm not using that crappy plastic knife anymore. Oh, yeah. So cool. I don't know about uh, about knives. So I got tack, tack Force. My friend was like, Tack Force? I don't know what he said back. But anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And subscribe. Come on. Focus on her. And subscribe to see so much more uh, content. Subscribe to see uh, Aries, the Aries review and the Build-A-Figure review. So, and you know, the Build-A-Figure because I've been talking about it a little bit. So, anyways, please subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thanks for watching.